Hey, sexy. Hi, handsome. So, how is our little man doing? As hyper as his father. Oh. Hyper? I only manifest the fruit of the Holy Spirit. Very simple. Whether you like it or not. I hear you, Mr. Manifesta. <laughs> oh, let's be. Don't touch it. Do you want to teach this boy bad manners, ABB? Before you take something that doesn't belong to you, always remember to say, please. Point of correction, ABB. What I bought with my own money, my hard earned money. For who? Okay. Can I pick one here, man? Please. Nope. 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 That is why I never bothered asking. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, both of us are carrying this baby. But you are the one doing the chopping. Miss Choppins. And let it be. Let me be Mrs. Choppins. I've heard. Okay, okay. Just bring the plates. Let, let me give you myself. Okay. If I leave you now, you pack everything in. Oh, you just okay. only this one. Okay. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Keep this thing. Hey! Oh, yeah, no hey. I hope you're not trying to change it because the matter I told you about will soon start. Honey, it's please. It's movie time. Please. No. It's, it's almost time for the ball I told you earlier that we're going to watch. The it's movie soon... time. It's yeah. movie time on so many TV. Nope, nope, nope. Is it because I brought out the remote? I'll go and hide it again. No? Okay, okay. <laughs> Don't hide. <laughs> I'm not hide. I'm so heavenly father. We thank you once again for the gift of this baby which we're expecting. We pray, oh Lord, that he will be a source of joy and blessing to us. Amen. And also, that will be the same to him. Amen. Heavenly Father, please bless us with all the resources needed for his welfare. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. Let us share the grace. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now forever. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall reign with us forever and ever. Trying to see how a boy is doing this morning. And? Pure. 100%. I am sure he thinks he's in a football pitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, how was oh, the night? Awesome. Hope you slept well. Same, same. And I'm um, speaking of awesome. I already prepared a meal this morning. Yes. What? <laughs> what did you I've served it too. <clears throat> did you even sleep at all? Does it matter? The most important thing is that <laughs> my wife's breakfast has been served. And she needs to take her time and rest from all the chores. She has been doing all this work. Anyway. For your information, I woke up early this morning because I needed to be very early in the office this morning. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So, 
What are you still waiting for? <laughs> so, <sighs> take it easy. It's easy, 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 easy. Thank you. You're the best husband in the whole of this nine planet. Joy, I thought we have eight planets. <laughs> what are the only things? Come and eat food, eh? Again, not, not again. <laughs> Remember what the doctor said. If you continue the what doctor? Sorry for the loss. Please take heart. My brother, Uche, I'm still trying to figure out what my crimes are. This is not fair, Tom. This is not fair. My brother, sometimes this life is just not fair at all. But I know you pull through. I know. How is Joy? How is she handling all this? Oh. She's in shambles. Yeah. I can count how many times she has spoken since we came back from the hospital. Yes. Uche. Mm -hmm. I am drowning in my own grief. That I I don't even have the courage, the fortitude. 
to console my wife. Nandu, it's okay. It's okay. Once again, I'm so sorry for what happened. Take care, brother. Bro, open this door. Open this door, Tom. Tom, we're in this together. We're in this together. Open this door. Open this door. Not eating anything all day. I'm not hungry. <laughs> Honey, you need to eat something so that you not develop ulcer. Ulcer is ten times better than the pain I'm going through right now. Okay. I I understand what you've gone through, Madam. That was why I took my time to make your favorite spicy jollof rice. You see, just eat it and then you will see the difference. I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. Ah. Ah. Okay, okay, okay. Eat. Um, just take a bite. Namdi, I don't want to take a bite. I don't want to eat anything. Don't you get it? Will spicy jollof rice bring back my son? Will it? Oh, honey, this is very sumptuous and delicious. Uh, you will like it if you eat it. Let's do our night devotion. Honey, let's pray now. Pray for what exactly? For what reason? Honey, 1 John chapter 4 verse 19 says, God first loves us before we even love him. And it goes further in the book of Romans chapter 8 verse 28 clearly stated that all things work it unto good for those who trust in God. I want us to understand something, baby. Let us talk to God. Let us continuously talk to Him. You can go ahead and pray. Or is it talk to Him? And while you're at it, please ask Him. 
why he is so wicked. Ask him what I did wrong that made him to hate me this much. Please ask him that. Father Almighty, we come to you. You come to him, not we. Almighty Father, we are sincerely, honestly, pray to you. This family, actually we are grieving because of our loved one that we lost. But Almighty King, we ask you with deepest humility, do not take whatever my wife is saying to you to heart. Yes, because we are just mere mortals that are grieving because we, love, we lost a loved one. Almighty God, we praise you for even in the sorrow we are going through, Father King of Glory, we know that it is only you that can comfort us. And therefore we ask you to comfort this family the only way you can so that we will be comforted. Father King of Glory, we know what you said in the book of Psalm, that those who put their trust in you are loud like Mount Zion that can never be shaken. Father, we put our trust. This family put our trust in you. We ask you in your benevolence, Show mercy to this family. Nandi, it's been two weeks now. I mean, I'm not saying two weeks is too long for you to mourn the death of your child. But you will lose your job if you don't show up at it. You know this life is not too fair to men as it is to women, you know that. I know, my man. It's, it's just difficult for me to function optimally. Besides, uh, you know how long my wife and I have waited for... I know. Anandi, I know. I get it. I mean, I don't even know what it will be for me to be in your shoes like right now. But having financial problems will compound the issue. And that is exactly what will happen to you if you lose your job. Think about it. I appreciate your concern towards my family. Um, um, I'll try and do something then. Um, let me get you something to drink. No, no, it's okay. I'm fine. Are you sure? Don't bother, don't bother. I'm fine. I'm fine. Don't worry. I'm fine. I'm fine. What joy exactly? What joy? Though my name is Joy, but you have obviously changed it to sadness. There's no joy. No more joy. No joy. No joy. No joy. No joy. No joy. No joy, 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 God, you have killed joy, you have killed joy, God. What did I do wrong? God, what did I do wrong? God, what did I do wrong? God, what did I do wrong? Where is my son? Oh. <laughs>
Eh, bu be. Bu be. Mami. My son is calling out to us. He's calling out to us. Oh, honey, what, what did I tell you? Huh? This is just a nightmare. No, it's not. I saw him. I'm very sure I saw him just now. Just now. It's mm. not a nightmare. Oh. Oh. Honey, okay, let's go back to sleep. I eh? saw him. Oh, oh, I okay. saw him, babe. I understand. Huh? Babe, I saw him. Mm. Mm. Come back, come back. Uh. Come back. to take care of myself. Don't worry about me. Are you sure? Because you are more or less like a, a train wreck. I know it's hard for you. But it's hard for me too because I lost my son. Yes. And now I have to babysit you. Then don't. I didn't beg you to do that. I, 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 Joy, I, I don't mean to sound like that. I didn't mean it like that. Uche, I don't know what to do again. As it is now, I am gradually losing my mind. Well, I am not a counselor, nor a therapist. Mm. And I understand that events like this can be overwhelming for two. I think you need help. I understand. With the deepest humility in me, I know I need help. But what of my wife? My own joy. She doesn't believe she needs to see anybody. Why don't you invite her sister over? I think it's a good idea. She convinced her not to come around. Reason. She is okay. That is the more reason why you should call her yourself. I would have suggested you call your mother or hers. But unfortunately, they are no more. May their soul rest in peace. Amen. But, but um, I think, um, I think uh, it's a very good suggestion. Thank you, Papa. I will, I, will, I will talk to her. I'll talk to her. Right, let's drink. Honey, are you sure you'll be okay? All right, then. 
I made um, a break. I will. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Welcome. Honey, are you okay? Sure, um, I'm fine. Uh, are you okay? Okay. Oh, these. Huh. I forgot to take them back. Oh, don't bother. I will take them in. Yes, um, honey. Yeah. You are not fine. You are not okay. You need help. Both of us need help. I don't need help. How many times do I have to tell you that I'm okay before you believe me? You are not fine. This is not the joy I got married to. This is not my joy. Babe, this is me. Is this not me? This is me now. Am I a ghost? Honey, this is... I'm afraid this is gradually becoming... Uh, a new normal for us. How? Honey, I love you and heaven knows that I can do anything humanly possible to keep our child. But hey, this is life. Sometimes we lose and sometimes we gain. No. 
You gave up our son. You gave our son up. What was I supposed to do? It was either you or him. You were supposed to save him. Save our baby. That's what you're supposed to do. Save our baby. Save me from this misery that I'm into right now. I'm tired. Honey, honey. I can't imagine the thought of losing you. I, I can't. No, I'm tired. I'm, I'm tired. It's my son. Honey. Where's my son? Where's my child? Okay. Where's my son? It's okay. Daphne, where's my son? Honey, it's okay. <laughs> Honey, I don't uh, I don't know if you might be able to make dinner today. Uh, you see, I, I might be coming late today because I'm trying to crack down on the workload of jobs. The long absence. Uh, okay, okay. I will. Uh, you know what? Um, don't need to bother yourself. I will do that when I come back. Eh? Just take your time, have rest. Babe, I said I will. Don't worry about me, I'll be fine. Just focus on your work, please. Uh, you'll be fine. Yes. Babe. Um, okay, okay. Uh, uh, let me run along there. Okay. I love you. Was I a bad wife? Or were you scared I was going to be a terrible mother? Where is my child? But I could have learned. Whatever you wanted me to do, I would have done them. God, where is my child? Where is my Ibube? Is my able big God?
Hey, babe. Hello. How are you doing, my love? I'm fine. Ah. Uh, oh. Okay. 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 Okay, fine. Okay, see you soon. Bye. 5.30. Oh! Charlie's her life dating. <laughs> wow. Mm. Wow. Mm. Mm. This food, it, it looks appetizing. Babe, did you add salt in the soup? Think so. Why? You think so? Did I hear you say why? Look, I'm tired of all this rubbish. You are not the only one grieving here. I also grieve. You're yelling now. I am yelling. I will continue to yell. Help me to help you. Look at you. What do you want me to do? Now, let us go to a therapist. You don't want to go. Let us go to a counselor. No. Now, you can't even go out of this house. Neither will you allow anybody to come to the house. Not even your siblings. Both of us coexist in this house. Yet, you don't talk to me. For the past three months, you are all by yourself. You don't want me to help you. I must help you. You need a help. I don't need help. I don't need help. Joy. Joy. Let me warn you for the last time. It's either you accept that you need help, else things will fall apart. Rubbish. Oh, baby. This soup looks nice now. Looks nice. Hi, sis. You have lost too much weight. You didn't tell me you were coming. I've been calling you, but you did not pick my call. But then they said you need my help. That is why I'm here. I see. Welcome. You had no right to bring her here without my consent. This is our house. Honey, this is your sister we are talking about. Isn't that the more reason why I should why I should have the final say? Babe, I am not here to pick up a fight with you. I'm already exhausted from the day's walk as it is. She's only here to help both of us. I don't need help. I can handle my home. And, and who is doubting you? Are we disputing it? It's obvious. It's obvious. I failed as a mother. And now I'm failing as a wife. No, 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 <laughs> no, no, no don't go there. No. Don't go there. Honey, please listen to me. This is just a temporary arrangement. Once you can function unassisted, she's free to leave. Now look at me. I failed. <laughs> look I'm at me. Female. You are not. Look at me, the eyes. 
and tell me you are not a failure. We are in things together. Sister, lunch is served. I'm not yet hungry, thank you. But you barely touched your breakfast. I appreciate your concern, Amaka. But I'm an adult. I'll eat when I'm hungry. Are you sure? Well, if it's fine by you, no problem. Sister. Sister Joy. What? What? Sister, you can't continue like this. You have become a shadow of yourself. What's your business with how I look? Forgive my tone. But... But what? What exactly do you mean by I can't continue like this? Okay, I can't continue sitting on the couch in my own house. Eh? No, 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 no. Just tell me what you mean. Because I, 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 I can't grab it. What? Sister, you're my only sibling. I love you like life itself. When Mama died, you raised me like you were my mother. We lost Papa just last year. I don't want to lose it too. I don't want to lose it. I don't want to lose it. Look, this is exactly why I don't want anybody else to come here. Let me just deal with only Namdi's Wahala. Go and eat. Just leave this place, please. But I just ate. Hey, go and read your books. Or don't university students read anymore? Go and read. What are you even watching? Nothing in particular. Just scanning through the channels to see what is good for me to watch. <laughs> in my own case, I stick to football matches. That is the only thing that makes my subscription meaningful. <laughs> <laughs> what the? You are football. Mm. Joy. She used to hide this remote controls. And I would chase her around the house. Playfully. We used to run around this house like we're five years old kids playing hide and seek. It's a pleasure hearing her laugh and smile. It's a pity. I can't remember the last time I had this type of laugh in this house. Brother, <laughs> everything will be fine. I believe. Um, and um, how, is she, how is she doing today? Not much improvement. She barely ate. I'm sure. She need a little more time. I wish there is something I can do to bring my sister herself back instantly. Don't even go there. You have done an awful. Eh? You left school to come here to assist us. Amaka, you have done noble. Thank you. 
Yeah, welcome, brother. God will see us through this. Indeed. He, he, he will. Tonight, I'm tired. Oh, I said I'm tired. Don't you understand when I say I'm tired? Nandi Nandi. Oh, wow. Hey, but oh, wait, oh. where have you been all these days? Uche, life is life in myself and my wife in a very hectic man. That reminds me of how about your wife? Uh, any improvement? She's there. Anyway, um, my sister in law is around. I'm just hoping that things will work out fine now. It has to. It will. It will work out. And uh, what about you? How have you been faring? <clears throat> Hanging on. Oh. Bro, God will come through for you, I believe. <laughs> we keep on throwing up God in every discussion when we don't even need it. I don't understand. What do you mean? How do you expect that big man up there to leave all the important things he has to do to worry over my wife and I? What are you saying, bro? You know that God has always come through. Hmm? My life is a testimony, and you know this. And even about you. And I'm sure if you check yourself very well, you will also realize that God has come through for you. Uche, come off it. Come off it, Uche. My life has been hell lately. And I came here to unwind. To drink. To, 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 to have fun, my friend. And you are telling me God. God this, God that. What on earth? One way I forward and I... in a nightclub. Do you want to wake up my baby? I'm sorry, sister. This is just a temporary arrangement. Once you can function unassisted, she's free to leave. Thank you. 
Honey? Sorry, who are you talking to? When? Um, I, I heard you talking to someone. Um, oh, sorry, it might be my imagination. <laughs> it's okay. I prepared my mind. You prepared moi moi. You don't want to eat that. No, if you don't want to eat moi moi, tell me whatever I want to eat and I'll go and prepare it immediately. You know you work so hard during the week. And today is Saturday. Oh, that's true. Uh, I, I've never disturbed my mind in a very long while. I, 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 I want to eat. I yes. want to eat my mind. Yes, I want to eat. Okay, let's go. Okay, yeah. Yes. Eat my mom. Yes, eat my mom. Did it? Okay. <laughs> Rest at all? You've been working since morning. Don't worry, I'll rest after this. Do my baby. Let me finish up. Hmm? Let me finish up. No, I will do it. Let me finish up. Ah. Or oh, do you want Mama to accuse me of maltreating you from her grave? <laughs> okay, go and take some ice cream. Yeah, there's ice cream in the freezer. Okay. me. I am sorry. I never mean to. It's okay. You look gloomy. Come. What's bothering you? I need to sort out something in school. I've been trying to see if my friends can help me out. But they're not. Oh, is that why you look as if you want to cry? Hmm? No, don't worry. I've been meaning to tell you to go back to school. You can go back to school, okay? Don't worry. I'll not be away for more than one week. I will try my best to come and see you. <laughs> you worry too much. You worry too much, Amaka. Look at me. I'm fine. I'm completely fine. Was this the way you met me? Hmm? I'm no longer a shadow of myself. See. Come. When you get back to school, I want you to concentrate on your studies. I want you to be a good girl and make me proud. Okay? Okay, sister. <laughs> I miss you. I miss you too. It's been a long time I heard that. You can say that again. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Naughty, naughty. <laughs> Excuse me. Did I do anything wrong? No. Is my mouth smelling? I never said so. Then what is it? Not 
something. What's the essence of the long journey when there's a shortcut? Just come and enter. So that you will not hurt him. Huh? Take it easy. Hurt who? Never mind. <sighs> She's either going crazy or I have totally lost my mind. No, 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 no. Uche, I, I am not laughing. This is not a laughing matter. Even my late parents, they had a, a better sexual orientation to make the matter worse. She started crying afterwards. And she believes she was genuinely making my work easier. What? Wasn't she though? God forbid evil. It will be like having intercourse with the cops. You need to calm down, man. Seriously. These days it feels like she's talking to herself. When I ask, she will tell me she's not talking to herself and even swear. And you think that should calm down? Well, I get how you feel, but you need to take things easy. We should talk in person, okay? <laughs> Honey, I'm back. Guess what I have for you? <laughs> Welcome back, Sumi. What's the meaning of this? Meaning of what? This thing you're carrying. Oh, this. <laughs> I, I couldn't make him to stop crying while I was cooking. So I figured out he wanted to cook with mommy. See, it worked. He has stopped crying. <laughs> Babe! What? Can't you see that I am gradually losing you? You are slipping away. Please come back! No! I'm here! We are here, Ebu and I. Can't you see? See now, he has started crying because of what you said. Sorry, baby, sorry. Joy, you are only hallucinating. There is nothing here. This is just ordinary. No! Teddy bear! Do you want to hurt my son? You are doing sinner! No, I want to hurt my child. Sorry, Bube, sorry. Sorry.
Uche, how long have we been friends? Uh, barely six years now. Six years, good. Have I ever joked in this manner before? This is no joke. I told you, my wife has gone loco. Did I hear you well? You mean she's... as in loco loco? Whatever name you want to give it. I will look on whatever. I just told you there is fire on the mountain and you're asking me if the bush is burning. Hello. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Wow. Well, How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine. I heard voices, so I decided to come and see who my darling husband is talking to. Uh, yeah, yes. <laughs> you're welcome. Yeah. Okay. Let me leave the two of you to catch up. Hmm? <laughs> so what, what should I get for you guys? Uh, um, water will be okay. Uh, Uche says he doesn't need anything. All right. I'll be right back. Oh, uh, uh, okay. But she's fine now. She is not fine. I slept on the couch throughout the night. I was afraid. Yes, I was afraid she would do something very funny. She's wow. mm. oh. oh, thank you. Thank you, my dear. You're welcome. Thank you very You're welcome, much. baby. Um, mm. let me go back to Ebube before he starts crying again. That boy can cry. He can cry for Africa. <laughs> At this rate, eh, I'll be forced to nickname him Cry Cry Baby. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he <laughs> cries so much. I don't know. Mm. He has started crying again. <laughs> See you some other time, Uche. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm coming, baby. He's coming, baby. Did I just hear her say that exactly what I've been telling you here? This is serious, girl. Very, very serious. Uche, as a matter of fact, I am afraid. I don't know what to do. I don't know if I go to work and come back. I'll find down the street. No, no, no. It hasn't gotten to that. No, nothing, nothing like that will happen. But then, something has to be done and done fast. I think your wife is going through a denial state of grief. She is trying to cope with the tragedy. And denying it happened seemed to be the best option for her now. Oh. I'm tired. Totally exhausted. I understand it is tough, my friend. But you have to tough it out. <laughs> Women experience grief differently from men. And when it happens to do with the death of a child, it's even more challenging. Nandi, this is time to be sympathetic and kind. Your wife needs you now more than ever. I've tried, honestly. You know what I can do? You want me to swear by my late father's grave? Oh, I've tried. I don't know where to go from here. I think it's time for you to meet the counselor. I will send you a counselor's contact. You guys can go and see him. She will not agree to go with me. You know that. I've told you this a number of times. If Muhammad cannot go to the mountain, the mountain should be brought to Muhammad. Mr. Nandi, so how are you coping with the loss of your son? Um, um, well, um, it's been the toughest moment of my life. I feel like a, an inflated balloon that's been blown around by the wind. Uh, uh, my greatest fear is that uh, I may, I might. Uh, uh, explode 
at any time. Yes. I empathize with you. Grief does that to you. Uh, how about you, Mrs. Joy? Uh, what about me? Okay. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's okay. You see, the foundation of our meeting here today is built on transparency and freedom of expression. Okay? So we need to be open to each other. That's the only way we can find solution to this problem. So, Mrs. Joy, what I mean to ask is, how are you coping with the loss of your son? His name is Ibube. And he's not dead. I don't know what my husband told you. But he's upstairs sleeping and he doesn't like noise. It, it, it's okay. I'm so sorry about that. Sorry to have intruded into your family. Do we continue these proceedings after he wakes up? Which proceedings? The only reason you're here is because you think my son is dead, right? Okay, let me advise you. Please, go back to your family because nobody is lost here. Honey, you should stop this. No, you should stop this. You should be the one to stop this. It's a pity you can't even defend your poor son in front of strangers. Honey, 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 it, it's okay, Mr. Ndamli. Mr. Ndamli, hear me out. It's all right. You see, people respond to grief differently. To some people, it makes them turn against themselves. While others, it manifests differently. It makes them to totally turn their backs on the trauma in the first place. So how long will this go on for? Well, as a counselor, I've cancelled numerous families and I've come out with one lesson. Grief does not have a terminal date. Okay? You just have to throw your burden to God and with time, He rolls it away, I assure you. I can understand that. My wife might be correct after all. This is just a waste of resources and time. Mr. Namde, when last did you pray? And who said I'm a Christian? That on the wall. The unalloyed, ignorant word of God. Friend! I know there was a time you believed in those words. Those words were flames of fire in your bones. I'm a Christian counselor. I know there was a time you believed on those words. As a counselor, I don't force my faith on people. But there is something I would like you to know about grief. Grief is like a robber. And it doesn't stop until he finishes you. He starts with your faith, your vibrant faith. He attacks it. Then he proceeds to your joy. Then, finally, he tries to destroy your peace of mind. Listen to me. If you don't put a firm feet on the ground, I advise you to do that. So you don't begin to talk of losing much more than your son in this season. Mr. Namde, like I said, I empathize with you. Today you are in a valley, but you are not alone. I am with you and I will see you soonest, hopefully. And one more thing. As the head of your family, be the verb, the energy, inspiration your wife, draw strength in this time of trauma and pain. Thank you. Oh. I will be on my way now. Please take care of your home. Jesus name we pray. Amen. Father King of glory we thank you for all your overwhelming love for us. Father your love for us is unfathomable. Father we are overjoyed 
Because even when we are in the deepest valley, you will neither forsake nor leave us. Amen. Father, we acknowledge your supremacy. We acknowledge your greatness in our life. We thank you for this pregnancy, Father, King of Glory. Thank you, Jesus. You are worthy to be praised because I remember clearly what you told us in the Bible. Those who worship the Lord can neither be forsaken. Father, we thank you. Thank you we glorify your name. Thank you, Jesus. Heavenly King, because you have proven to us through this pregnancy that those who put their trust in God are like Mount Zion that can never be shaken, that can never be moved. Yes, Father, may your name be adored. Father, King of glory, yes, we return all the praise, all adoration. Thank you, Jesus. May the glory, may all adoration, all blessings go back to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Ancient of days, as old as you are, as old as you are, you will never change. Ancient of days, as old as you are, as old as you are, you will never change. Ancient of days, I come before you. I know you never change it. I know your words. Father King of Glory, what you do cannot do does not exist. Father King of Glory, I am very certain of your word in the book of Exodus 14, 13. That Egyptians we see today, we shall see no more. Father King of Glory, I want you to go and fight this battle for us. Go before us and fight this battle for this family. Father, I know your word. It is very clear. In John chapter 6 verse 20, you told me not to be afraid. My Lord and my God, I believe you and I believe in the testimony that any moment from now, this family must receive their healing. We must come out from our drowning position. We must continue to extol your name. If anybody should be shouting, downcasting, we must be shouting uplifting. Upliftment must be our name in the name of Jesus. And so, Heavenly Father, 
As we begin our day today, Lord. we declare, yes, Lord. we decree and declare yes, Lord, Lord, my that Lord. your joy shall be a strength in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. King of glory, your joy shall be a strength in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen and amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yeah, amen. Indeed, your joy shall be a strength in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord and my God. In the mighty name of Jesus. So Amen. <sighs> I don't know. Just have that knowledge that we should pray again. Because the Bible tells us pray in season and out of season. See? Mm. Um, I forgot something very important. Why don't we do that little freaky freaky? I will turn. Please, Mr. Freaky Freaky. I'll be late for my appointment and you will be late for work. And if, if I'm late for work and they sack me, I'll come back here and we'll continue from where we stop. And you see, I will navigate you from freaky freaky to soccer on me. <laughs> and this time around. <laughs> Number one in giving bad advice. Okay. Special advisor. S.A. Mm -hmm. yes. Special bad advisor. Okay, okay, see. Why not do it? We do it this way. Mm -hmm. Okay. You go to work. Uh -huh. I'll go to my appointment. Okay. And when we come back, we'll turn this place upside down. What do you say to that? Wait, wait. Uh, you mean this... Hmm. This whole building? Turn the whole place upside down. Deal! 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 Leave me out! Jesus went for you, my Savior went for us. All the way to Calvary, he went for me. He died to set us free, set us free. All the way to Calvary, he went for me savior went for you jesus went for us all the way to calvary he went for you he died to set house Free. Thank you, thank, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for everything you have done in 
la famille Why didn't you give me the umbrella when you knew the time around? Oh, sorry, baby. Mm. So, how was work today? Um, just like work. You know, this has become your default response. Always just like work, just like work. Anyways, I made something delicious. And I bet you would love it. Um, what could that be? You have to wait and see. And wait and see, wait and see. <laughs> <laughs> I get to wear this. <laughs> Don't say that, honey. We can always adopt a child. Be would have been a smart kid. He sure would have. Please calm down. Okay, as pretty as ever. Thank you. Come. I know you are nervous. I am too. But the truth of the matter is that we are going to just for castle and session, and nothing more. Eh? We'll be fine. All right. <laughs> okay, let me go by the left. <laughs> Babe, I'm so glad that I still have my spot at the office. I'm glad that you still kept it for me. But I'm somehow nervous. <laughs> Honey, they know you are a very great asset. Just take a deep breath. You will always succeed. Thank you very much. You are always welcome. Mm -hmm. Um, where is my khaki? Oh, mm -hmm. Hold on. Mm -hmm. 
Let me. Are you leaving me behind? Ah. How do you mean? Leaving my better half? I'm I'm only going to warm the car so that um when you come out. Uh, okay, you okay, that's one minute. All right, all right. Mm -hmm. eh? The joy of the Lord is our strength. Sleeping beauty. Good morning, babe. Morning. Were you watching me? No, I'm not watching you. I'm admiring the blinding beauty from God. <laughs> My morning face is blinding you. I don't believe you. This is more profound that you are this beautiful. Very early in the morning. God, I thank you for your perfect work of creation. <laughs> ah, and that reminds me, I've never heard this kind of laughter in a very long time. Can you help me out? I mean, laugh for me. Laugh for me, please. <laughs> me, very funny. <laughs> I love you so much. I love you. And I love you more than you can ever imagine. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. That test strip, what is it doing inside there? You found it. I forgot to dispose it. How did it get there in the first place? Baby, it was supposed to be a surprise. What surprise are we talking about? Um, I went to the hospital today and 
I got the pregnancy test results today. You're pregnant. Are you sure? Oh, yes. how, how, how is it possible? Because I know what the medical experts, several of them have said about. No, I'm as surprised as you are. That was why I did my own test myself, so I'll be double sure. Even the doctor said he has not seen anything like this before. It's a miracle, baby. Yahweh, your name is Yahweh. You are a miracle walking God. Your name is Yahweh. Yahweh, Yahweh, your name is Yahweh. You are the miracle. Walking God, your name is Yahweh. Yahweh, your name is Yahweh. You miracle walking God, your name is Yahweh. 